Meet Madra, a medical autonomous droid remote assistant. The robotic dog can travel across a range of terrain at speeds of up to 25 kilometres per hour, providing first aid supplies in hard to reach areas. It's just one element of this wide-ranging initiative that uses cutting-edge tech to improve and enhance the provision of health care on Clare Island. This is a really exciting frontier of medicine here, the Digital Health Home Health Project between Cisco and Science Foundation Ireland. And what we're doing here is we're democratising health care. We're making sure there's health care for all, which is one of the UN's Sustainable Development Goals uh, ambitions to make sure that no matter where you are in the world, you have equal access to health care. How are you feeling today? 5G connectivity is being provided to homes across the island, allowing residents to have remote clinical appointments with their doctors who have access to up-to-the-minute readings provided directly by patients. People are, are delighted to get involved with it and the more people that have, have gotten involved, the more people that want to get involved. So we've had buy-in from nearly the entire island. The use of all these technologies is in marked contrast to communication methods used here over the decades. Residents like Chris O'Grady, who's in his 91st year, say they've seen amazing changes in those years. If somebody wanted a boat out to Runa, for instance, the neighbours would tell the people, the local people, say, would you get a bag of hay in an old shed out there or a rig hay somewhere and set it alight? And the smoke from it will be seen and they'd know someone want, wanted a boat. The project aims to augment existing health services on Clare Island. Those who've devised it say it could be easily replicated in remote locations around the country and around the world. That's absolutely what we hope it would be, yes, to really harness that, um, the motivation, the momentum that the project has gathered and the success and really, I suppose, see where we can take it, yeah. Pat McGrath, RTE News, Clare Island, County Mayo.